Welcome everyone and thank you for being here on this very special day among close friends and family. We have gathered here to rejoice in one of life's greatest moments and to give recognition to the worth and splendor of love. This horizon, it's shining, seems the daylight knows this is our time now. We both know we had something special, but uh, we knew pretty quickly that a perfect match wasn't going to be enough. It took a lot of work, sacrifice, compassion, compromise. ago I walked into a conference room in Greensboro and you stood up to greet me which was strange to me. <laughs> Little did I know that day I had met the man of my dreams. Every day with you has been a dream come true and I can't believe this is our life so full of love and laughter and late night drives. So today I promise you that I will never give up on us and I will always put our relationship first. I will never take for granted or ignore the things you sacrifice for us. You are the best part of my day every day and I will never assume you know. giving me a life beyond my wildest dreams. You are more than I could have ever hoped for. I love you so much. By the authority vested in me by the state of North Carolina, in as much as you, Jordan, and you, Rebecca, have announced the truths that are already written in your hearts, you have declared yourselves to be husband and wife. You may now file a joint tax return. <laughs> but more importantly, you may now kiss the bride. Keep laughing. Don't be afraid to laugh at yourself. Life is hard, messy, and short. It's important to have someone along for the ride who can laugh at their mistakes, who can find humor or goodness even in the darkest times, and who strives to at least once a day bring a smile to your face. For my decades worth of friendship with Beck, I know she can do that. truly been the best friend I could ever ask for um, and you have always done everything exceedingly well and even over the top. He's always gone over the top and I have seen that in this relationship that he doesn't just do the bare minimum. Um, he loves you truly like 1 Corinthians 13 says you should love and that is undoubtedly the way that you love each other. and. Um, there's, there's no doubt in my mind that it's going to go the distance. It's just been a wonderful journey to watch our daughter grow as her relationship with Jordan has also grown. 
And it is evident, I think, from everybody here, from listening to the vows, and from just knowing them, that they are really better when they are together. <laughs>